Mm, no thanks. What? What did the game just load? I was opening a drawer and then it loaded something. Yes! I bet that's going to happen. How do they know about me? This is really cool, actually. It's really cool that I just, like, I, I thought I was maybe just finding a small bonus thing getting up there that ladder. I thought maybe the only thing I was finding was that one picture, but then it leads up to this whole, like, above the ground walkway thing that then leads into a window into an apartment building. Where are we exactly? Yeah, right here. Which is maybe going to lead out and allow me to continue past where this tree was blocked off or broken. I thought it was something small, but it turned into something big. Really intrigued about what I'm going to find in all these rooms. What's that? Ammo? Pistol bullets. Yes. Hmm, just automatically reloaded. Nice. Hmm? What was that? from this corner or something. That sort of vaguely looks like Alessa. Pentagram. I heard he was in here, right? Yeah, I think so. Cool picture or painting, whatever it is.
Looks like a couple's place. That's odd. Lots of roses around. Used to be a picture there. You again? <laughs> Such a bright bottle of ketchup. Just a big picture of a tomato. Nice. I love fictional branding of common household objects in games. There's some more up there. They love ketchup in this household. I feel like I'm missing something in this place. Is there a secret button or something? No, seems to be it. Dear shithead, <laughs> I'm on to you, you junky asshole. Next time something goes missing from my apartment, you can expect the cops to come knocking on your door. And if it's not them, it'll be me. And my knock is 12 gauges, if you catch my drift. So, if you don't want an ass full of buckshot, I suggest you stay the fuck away from my apartment. Last warning. A thief, huh? Something that I noticed during that fight, by the way, is that... The world doesn't pause when you open your inventory, which means when I needed to take out my handgun, I wasn't safe to just take my time. I had to scramble to do it before I took more damage. Also, I picked up pistol ammo, and apparently that didn't even give me a full seven shots. It gave me five? Stingy. Oh, shit. Jesus. Let's get the shit out of me. I just saw the legs. Hmm. Can I get him down? I guess not. Burning books. We need to go downstairs and go to the street level to get past the broken building part. I mean, broken street part. Just say I could finally put this damn bag down for starters. Man, cut the bullshit. What is this place? Can't say I understand the question. This is a busy town. Do you think these letters deliver themselves? Whatever. Can you at least tell me where the radio station is? Someone's been calling in, making these <laughs> dedications to me. Oh, sure. That'd be the tall building in the center of town. Big old monster of a clock at the top. Shouldn't be hard to find. By the way, I ran into that lady friend of yours. What in the world you do to get that young woman so riled up anyway? She was fit to be tied. 
Tell you the truth, I got no idea. <laughs> Son, in my experience, when someone's that angry, it ain't a mistake. It's personal. And they're gone again. So the radio station's in the center of town, and it's the place with a huge clock on top. That'd be the painting slash picture that I saw, right? Look like a big clock tower. Also doubles as a radio station. Centennial building? Maybe that's it? It's got a question mark on it. Oh, yeah, so I am in a new place, right? I got past... Yeah, I got past the Broken Street. Or Closed Off Street. Closed Off. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> Sounds like there's a patrol car over there, too. Pitchfork if I wanted it. I'm good with a spear though. Probably need to follow where the mail delivery person went. Another one of these. That's the third one. Oh, hi. Some sort of cage around their face. I'm sad that this thing broke so yeah. quickly. I love the reach on it. Oh, having my light on probably makes me more visible, huh? I'll leave it off when I'm outdoors. <laughs> Pipe. Should be a pretty good weapon. Shouldn't break easily, I would think. Oh, oh, hi. You spawn out of nowhere. Uh, I should probably run from you. Oh, okay. Well, cool. That works. Vendors, fine arts, and appraisals. October 3rd, dear Mr. Rice, the Dalala painting in your collection needs to be in a public gallery, not the private home of a centric recluse who selfishly hoards such treasures for his sole enjoyment. I have tried repeatedly to get you to accept my generous offers to purchase the painting, but once again you rebuff me, leaving me no choice but to take drastic measures. 
it would be extremely unfortunate if certain details regarding your son's suicide were made public. Give me the painting and I'll assure you that these allegations will never see the light of day. Refuse me and face the consequences. Sincerely, Melissa Madlin. What a piece of shit. Details of your son's suicide. Could that be the person that I saw hanging from the fan earlier? The one who was a thief? Another one. Fender's Fine Art and Appraisals. How large is the map? 3x3 three three grid. Maybe I don't need the entire map to find the treasure. Who has the missing paintings? Cross-check with art collector quarterly. Who's buying New England 19th century oils? Mr. Rice won't return calls. A couple people marked off. Mr. Banter refuses to sell. What do the symbols mean? Native American. Maybe Al... I'm not sure how to read that. Um, call Pat at Silent Hill History Society. Maybe he knows. Death, burial site, ravens. Oh, we've seen a lot of ravens. Mr. Rice or Mr. Banter? Banker? Hmm. So 3x3 three three grid? But maybe they don't need all the parts. Okay, so... These look like different locations. Yeah, so... I'm gonna go on a treasure hunt at some point, it sounds like. Were there different locations marked on the map? Don't see anything. Wow, that map's doing some really interesting things. I need to take a close look at all the paintings. What do the symbols mean? Oh. Wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. Isn't... Isn't there, like, a UV light or something? Do I have it on my flashlight? Hmm, okay, yeah, so I don't have a UV light. I was thinking that because I saw it in one of the tips in one of the loading screens, but it looks like there's something called a forensic flashlight that you can find that has that, whereas what I have right now is a utility flashlight? Yeah, heavy utility flashlight. No UV anything. I was thinking maybe the symbols would be on the paintings in UV or something. Ugh. That doesn't even flush. Gross. There's the clock tower again. September 14th. Dear Mr. Barker, thank you for returning my inquiry regarding the Liliana Shelley painting. It's wonderful to find another like-minded collector, especially one that's so familiar with the early work of this local artist. I was, however, extremely disappointed to hear that you have chosen to reject my offer to acquire this piece from my gallery. You have to understand that we are assembling what the art review has called the most important and extensive collection of Shelley's early oils ever displayed. And refusing to sell or lend the painting to the gallery is not only a disservice to Silent Hill, but an insult to the greater art community. Your refusal to support the celebration of Shelley's work will only lead to misfortune. I beg you to carefully reconsider my offer. Sincerely, <laughs> Melissa Matlin. Refusal will only lead to misfortune. That's a... Definitely sounds like a threat. Just out of curiosity. Okay, you can mess it up a bit. I don't 
see any with special markings. Unless two of them being covered in blood counts. Is that the price of the last thing purchased? Accidentally went back outside for a second and got hit by that huge creature. That's why I'm a little bit bloody. Let's go downstairs. Oh, no, I just accidentally used a medkit again. Find the missing paintings. Yeah, so now I have an official quest for that whole thing. I wonder where it's gonna lead. The treasure. Okay, so we know Mr. Barker has at least one, right? And that other person also has one? Oh yeah, that's a 3x3 three three grid. So we've already got three of them? Gonna have to arrange them the right way once we got them all. So, let's get a look at what these paintings look like, so I can recognize another one of them. A lot of similarities. Yeah, I do see part of a symbol going through a bunch of them. Looks like they're all part of the scene that there's like a cloudy sky, it's sort of like reddish, there's really strong sun rays. Okay, I could probably identify one. I'm assuming none of the ones upstairs would be it. No, I don't think so. Gotta get it from other places. Okay, back outside, and I'm gonna run instantly as soon as it loads. Probably still gonna get hit, though. Nope, nope, wrong button. Wrong, wrong button. There we go. How did I not get attacked? Okay, they won't follow me here. I'm pretty sure I have to... Ooh. I think I kind of have to go this way, though. So maybe I gotta go this way? No. Did it lose track of me? No, no. I go from here. This is back where I was speaking with the mail delivery person, right? Oh, wait, no. No, it isn't at all. Right next to the Centennial Building, which is marked with a question mark. Wow. Maybe it was the light? I just heard either a voice or like some creaking, squeaking noises. 
get a fresh pipe. Oh. That is such a cool thing. Is that a weapon? <laughs> well, that's gonna break pretty fast. It's made out of ceramic, I think. Or clay. Train station? Pearl Creek. Take a sledgehammer. Ah, crap. Yeah, one of the hint screens also mentioned something about trying to unlock the subway to be able to travel faster across the map. So I guess that's eventually going to happen. The tip screen is actually really helpful. Where does it go? The car. It comes out of the fog and then it disappears into the fog, but like, look, it went this way. It couldn't have gone this way. Oh, shit. Strong attacks not working out. Cop car is here. Please don't see me. I think I'm just gonna run. Can you come in here? I don't think they can. Okay. Yeah. Probably should just run away from those. Where are we? Park or something? Yeah. Logan Park. gladly take this. I think its durability is terrible, but still, I like it. And I can bring down ladders. It's a little red thing tied up there. Downpour starting. Yeah, it's probably a pre-warning that a, a downpour is coming. Not that it's here yet. Oh, really? Thing looks like it's completely off its hinges almost. You found a Silent Hill artifact. 
Looks like the kind I built with Charlie. Something something. So I guess that's like a collectible, but it seems like it's something that actually comes from Pendleton Murphy's past. Uh, where is it? I don't actually know where it went. Right, well now I'm back out to the road where that monster was, the one I ran away from. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh. Yeah, it just disappears. <laughs> it's cool that it's stuck there like it made the crack in the earth. Hello. Oh, I need a password. Oh, this one only has three digits? Oh, no, it could take more, just a reflection thing. So far, I think I've found three things that need passwords, and I've never found any of them. Hmm. I should probably take this. Because this can definitely take down some wood. Oh! Oh my... God, okay, they can have weapons. Yes, 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 yes. They probably can't climb through there, right? Ooh. Maybe they only have weapons when it's in a downpour? Which I think it is at this point. Where am I? Wherever this is. Oh, whoa, I can actually go this way? I was about to turn back, thinking this wouldn't lead anywhere. Jeez. You really gotta pay attention. Um, is this somewhere I haven't been before? I'm not sure. I'm surprised how little signposting there is as to, like, where you can go and stuff. It's not very obvious at all. You kinda gotta, kinda just gotta go up to everything and try to use it. Now where am I? Does that say bank? Yeah. Old Silent Hill Bank. Okay, well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, we're going to explore the bank.